puppies deep in this week's pet parade. Our friends from Pawfic Life Rescue joining us today. So great to have you with us. And you want to talk about just a, a Pawfic story here. I mean, you guys, let's, before we take a look at the puppies individually, talk about your story because, I mean, this all started from your home. Yes, yep. We opened the rescue in 2013 out of our home in Uxbridge, and we had it there for about four or five years. And then about three months ago, we opened up a facility on 510 West Hartford Ave in Uxbridge on the old Bangmas farm, and we're able to help a lot more dogs now. Now have wonderful. some breathing room there in the household. Yes, the house is nice yeah. and quiet now. And now have room for these guys to run. So let's yeah. run through the line here. Who do we have here first? So that is Vivian. Vivian's a, a pup sweetheart. from Arkansas. Yeah. She's probably lab border collie mix. She's medium to high energy, loves to run and play she loves the water she's always so in the pool lovable are you kidding me yeah, so she's, she's the first to jump in she is yeah her and Aislinn yep they love it gotcha what what's her what's her backstory uh, she was picked up running in Arkansas just running around running around yeah too many dogs out there and not to be confused these are these are not sisters they're not relatives. they're not but they did come from the same rescue out in Arkansas um, and and Aislinn is uh, same age about five months but she was pulled from a, a that situation in a home with her f sister Zaley, who's already been adopted. Gotcha. All right. So, what's Aislinn's uh, story, though? Uh, Aislinn was just pulled out of a, a tough situation, a hoarding case, and uh, she was brought into uh, Friends of Wind County, uh, into the Humane Society, and uh, they are having trouble placing all the dogs they have, so they sent her north. Personality, mannerisms wise, she definitely seems to be the chillest of the three. She's super sweet and super chill. She loves everybody. <laughs> <laughs> and then down here at the end. Oh, this is our special girl. This is Izzy. Uh, she's a local surrender, originally came from Georgia, a sight unseen adoption, wasn't what the family had thought she was going to be, and um, unfortunately she was created nine or ten hours a day, and so she developed some anxiety. We've had her about three months, we've been working with her, and she's doing wonderfully, and Mason here has been helping a lot with her. She well done, loves Mason. kids, loves dogs, she's great. The, the secret to looking out for her there, you were saying that really kind of comes down to that pack mentality of dogs introducing... Absolutely. Yeah, our dogs have helped a lot. She really needed to be with other dogs and learn from them. Dogs are not meant to be kept crated in uh, solitary confinement for long hours. They're pack animals. They need to be with people. They need to be with dogs. And she's got that. Now she's doing wonderfully. Very nice. And these three about to have some company. You were saying you're expecting several dogs on the way out. We are. We're going to be getting quite a few dogs. Um, we're going to have a couple adoption events that are coming up, which we're really excited about. We have um, Pints for Pups at uh, Craft Roots Brewery in Milford, Mass. That's going to be on August 4th, and then on August 12th, we're going to be at New England Steak and Seafood, where we're going to have puppies on the patio. So we've got some great events. We're puppies going to be on the patio. I love it. Well yeah. played. I can feel these ta <laughs> the tails wagging up against me right now. They're such happy little puppies. They're such all cuties, great. too. All right, so if somebody wants to offer up their home, bring these guys in. Definitely. You can let us move. know. You can uh, apply online yeah. at pawficlifferescue.org. But these are all wonderful babies, and they're looking for great homes. We're really hoping to find a home for Izzy. She's a wonderful girl, and she's now ready for her forever so she needs a special home someone who's going to really take good care of her so sweet let's find a home for Izzy all right Excellent. for more information <laughs> cbsboston.com